Welcome to this video. This is a bit different simply because I got a viewer challenge and um, I invite all of you to do that as well. I'm playing on the ICC Internet Chess Club. If you'd like to challenge me to a game, I'll, um, I'll play and um, we'll do a video of the game. This is 3-2, yeah, 3 minute with a 2 second increment. Um, the time that I usually, yeah, that, that I actually do prefer due to, um, compared to 5-0. Um, note that this is a blitz game, not the 5 minute pool, the auto pairing, and this means that the ratings here are entirely different. It, um, the mine is um, a bit higher than at 5 minute, but here the general ratings are much higher. So this is not that great actually. I don't uh, play that um, kind of challenge system too often though. Um, okay, playing Chessaholic from the US, he challenged me. Um, he um, challenged me um, a while ago. Check. And we had uh, two games, and this time we'll also play two games. So a rematch um, is in order. And um, no matter how this game actually ends. Yeah, this is a bit of a disaster here. He didn't really get a five back. And this looks uh, looks really tricky now. Let's see. Yeah, I guess uh, there's there's more than good one good way to play. But this opens up the position the most, I think. Directly attacking e5. Yeah, I think f5 was uh, really a bit too early. Okay, let's grab on e5. Yeah, and now I can play e6 even, installing installing a pawn. Or this check here. Huh? Yeah, this is actually quite check. good. Huh? He must play knight e7 now, because the bishop here is hanging. And then uh, I have more than one good reply. Bishop f4 is uh, a nice one. Uh, threatening e takes d6. Mm -hmm. He's not going knight e7 immediately. That's surprising. Yeah, otherwise I'll just take f5. Yeah, as mentioned, the time is three minutes with two second increment. This is the official FIDE Blitz time. The Blitz um, World Championship, for example, is always played with this time control. And um, for those not playing with increment uh, too often, if you uh, imagine having a 60 move game, you would have exactly five minutes per player. So that means for most games it's very similar to 5 minute, only if the games are really much longer than 60 moves, they will become yeah, longer than 10 minutes overall. But it of course prevents those very silly um, time plays, this rook against rook and, and similar stuff. Okay, check. taking with check. And let's see. I can I can actually take e7 now. It's not not bad here. I'm threatening to to take on on d8. So let's see. Yeah, just the check, I guess. Check. A4 threatening knight b5 is nice. Let's let's try that. Threatening a mate in uh, in three knight b5 a b a b check knight a6 rook a6 and this is really hard to prevent. Check. Yeah, I guess there there was there was no way to prevent it. You can play queen a5. 
delaying the mate for a Check. move. Check. The bishop is on f4. Check mate. Yeah, this was uh, an opening, an opening disaster. F5 is just uh, just too much. Here you need to play d6 or knight f6, a normal move that uh, continues to um, to develop. Here it's um, the problem is that you don't um, you don't get it back and quite oops here quite um, it's not working here so quite similar to the oops <laughs> to the king's gambit this g4 move protects the pawn but also threatens to chase away the knight maybe h6 is relatively better but it's not uh, it's not really a playable position if you look at this white can amongst others even think about the immediate f4 attacking here it's it's just uh, just full of holes this position all right thanks for watching